ask what is elution in chromatography? Imagine you have a mixture of different substances, and you need to separate them to understand what each one is. This is where chromatography comes in, and a key part of this process is something called elution. Elution is essentially the process of extracting one material from another using a solvent. In chromatography, this means washing a solution through a column to separate the different components. Here's how it works. The solution you want to analyze is injected into a chromatography column, which contains a solid phase or stationary phase, usually a powder coated on a solid support. The components of the solution interact with this stationary phase in different ways. Some might stick more tightly to the stationary phase, while others might pass through more easily. To separate these components, a solvent, known as the eluent, is passed through the column. This eluent can either pass by the analyte stationary phase complex or displace the analyte by binding to the stationary phase itself. As the eluent moves through the column, it carries the analytes with it, and these analytes emerge from the column at different times, depending on how strongly they interacted with the stationary phase. This process is what we call elution. The time it takes for an analyte to emerge from the column is called the elution time, and the volume of eluent needed to cause this elution is the elution volume. For example, in liquid chromatography, the eluent might be a liquid that slowly filters through the solid stationary phase, bringing the separated components with it. The choice of eluent is crucial because it needs to have the right polarity relative to the sample and the stationary phase to ensure proper separation. In summary, elution in chromatography is a precise method of separating and identifying the components of a mixture by using a solvent to wash them through a column, allowing each component to emerge at a specific time based on its interactions with the stationary phase.